Okay, so now that we've wadded up our paper, we're going to use some black watercolor. So the first thing you're gonna do is wet that watercolor really good with your brush because you want it to be really watery. Remember, we don't dig down in the water into the watercolor pan. You just go one, two, three. That's enough paint for me, okay? And then you're just gonna brush that right over top of your watercolor. You're gonna keep adding some water to it to spread it out. And what happens is the watercolor goes down into the, all the cracks where you wadded up the paper and it makes a really cool textured effect, which is something that Jim Dunn's artwork has because he liked to um, do really thick paint and sometimes he even melted crayons and things like that to make a really heavy texture in his artwork. So this kind of gives a similar look and you wouldn't have to do this with hearts. You could do other things too. It's just kind of a cool technique that I wanted to show you. So just keep spreading this out. Until it's covered with the black. You don't want it to cover up all of the picture, you just want it to fill in all those little cracks. And then we'll take a paper towel or a towel, whatever you have handy, and kind of blot it a little bit to get the extra paint off. And then you have this really cool design. Here's another one that I made, just to show you a different variation. You know, you can do any kind of pattern that you like, but see how it leaves all these cool cracks in your art. It's very cool.